Hello dear students, in trick number 318, yet another amazing shortcut for solving a particular statement problems concerning finding the numbers which are consecutively occurring in the numbers. So this is a question in which we have to find three consecutive numbers. Now they can be either three consecutive numbers or three consecutive odd numbers or three consecutive even numbers. Now we have a separate method for finding the three consecutive numbers and even if the question is in the form of odd numbers or even numbers then we can apply the same method with a slight change. So the question is find the three consecutive numbers whose sum is 42. Obviously you will assume the first number as x, second as x plus 1, third as x plus 2 and then frame an equation in one variable and then you will solve that. But through this shortcut, you can find the answer directly. Whatever sum is given, just subtract 3 and divide it by 3. Yes, just subtract 3 and divide by 3. Remember, this is a shortcut for finding 3 consecutive numbers. If there are 4 consecutive numbers, then the method changes. So, 3 consecutive numbers, subtract 3 and divide by 3. So, you get... 42 minus 3 is 39 divided by 3. So the first number you get is 13. And what are the consecutive numbers? 14 and 15. So this is the answer for the question. Viewers, you can find this answer orally without use of pen and paper. I am sure with a practice of 10 minutes, you will be able to do this orally in a matter of just 3 seconds. So let us practice this once more. We have the same shortcut to be applied here now. We have the sum of the numbers given as 66. So subtract 3 and divide by 3. 66 minus 3 is 63. Divide by 3. So you get the first number is 21. So the consecutive numbers 22 and 23 which is the answer. You can just check the sum is 66. Here the sum of these three numbers comes out to be 42. Now what happens when we are given odd numbers and even numbers? Now this time a small change and you can do that using a shortcut. See when the numbers are odd or even you use the same shortcut. Whatever sum is given, this time subtract. You have to subtract a different number now. That number is 6 which is a double of the number which we were subtracting for getting the consecutive numbers. So subtract 6 and obviously divide by 3 is the same. So now this time you get 51 upon 3. So the first number in this case 51 upon 3 is 17 and since they are consecutive odd numbers so after 17 you get 19 and after 19 you get 21. So if you check the sum of these three numbers will come out to be 57. Apply this here again the same shortcut will work for even numbers also. The sum is 60, sorry 90 and now subtract 6 and divide by 3. So if you subtract 6 you get 84 by 3. This is 28 and what are the consecutive even number of 28? It is 30 and next number is 32. So the answer for the question is 28, 30 and 32. So if you check, add them you get 90 which is the correct answer. In competitions you will find this shortcut uh, of wide applicability and obviously in clerical grade examination and SSC exams, RRB exams, all numerical ability portion, they contain these amazing questions and these have to be solved using the shortcuts otherwise you will spend a lot of time using the traditional methods. So practice them and share the videos, subscribe the channel if you like this channel.